Hey, it's Rejections or Rejectives here and I'm playing some free for all on the map Underground on Modern Warfare 3 and I'm doing a topic commentary this time which is a little different from the usual content which I make and the reason I'm doing this commentary is because I feel it's very important for me to be talking about Christmas this year and I've grown wiser and I've grown older and I've actually learned to realise that Christmas is not what it should be in the world a lot of people don't celebrate it like it should be in my opinion but anyway i just like to say that I have no problem whatsoever with anyone that doesn't celebrate Christmas, maybe because of their religious views or maybe because of personal views. I have no problem whatsoever with people who don't celebrate Christmas. But anyway, Christmas for me has always been a time of the year where I would spend the whole day with my family, I would tell them how much I love them, I would show my appreciation towards them, I would show my, appreci I would show my appreciation towards every little thing they've done for me, every big thing they've done for me because they've always been there for me every step of the way and if it wasn't for them I wouldn't be here today in this world and I know at times I say stupid things like I hate you, I wish I wasn't born and stuff and I know that upsets them and it also upsets me when I say it but I regret saying stuff like that and I always apologise for it and I do love my family I love them so much and I'm not scared to say it and if you're one of those people who are maybe shy to say it or maybe thinks it's ridiculous to tell your family that you love them, then you need, you need a reality check because your parents, aren't, your parents aren't going to be around forever and there's going to be a, a day where you're not going to have the chance to tell them that you love them. And this is actually a really touchy subject for me and I find it hard to express my opinions about it but I'm giving it my, be my best shot anyway. But anyway... As I've said, Christmas for me has always been a time of the year where I'd tell my parents how much I love them, um, tell my family how much I love them, and show my appreciation towards them and just spend the day with them. But there are people in the world who seem to think that Christmas is about receiving the most expensive gifts and getting gifts and just receiving gifts in general. And I think this is a really ridiculous idea because if you're one of those people who always ask for lots of things at Christmas such as a new computer, a new laptop, a new game console, a new television, a new car or whatever. Um, it's just really ridiculous because you're upsetting a lot of people and you're not being realistic. Um, what I mean by this is not everything comes free in the world, not everything's cheap and not everyone can afford these things. Now, for an example, when I was in school, um, there's been cases where kids have went off crying because they've been so jealous of other kids and making them jealous and stuff like they've been so upset by other kids making them jealous because kids come into school as they do in high school and primary school and at college and all this stuff. They come in with all these gadgets after the holidays that they've got for Christmas and then they start telling people how much it costs them, thousands of pounds. I hear it every year, thousands, it costs them thousands. And then they start making other people jealous. And when other kids get jealous, it hurts them. And I'm a very sensitive person and I can feel their pain. And I've actually had it done to me before, which is very, very upsetting. When people try and make you feel as if you're nothing in the world. But anyway... If you're one of those people who always make little kids, not just little kids, any kid, anyone, if you make anyone feel jealous at Christmas, then you need to stop immediately because nobody should feel left out at Christmas. Nobody should feel like, nobody should feel in so much pain at Christmas. Nobody should feel sad at Christmas. It should be a happy time where we all just celebrate and be happy and be grateful that we're all still here because there are countless numbers of people who die in the world each and every single day and I'm sorry to say but that's just reality but anyway these people who make other kids jealous at school by bringing in all these gadgets aren't just making these kids upset they're also making these kids parents upset because when the parents see that their kids upset because they can't get what they want they're going to feel really bad because they can't afford to give their kid what they want and that makes the parent upset and not only does the parent get upset because of that some parents actually take out loans which puts them in debt 
just to give their kid what they want at Christmas. Now, take my advice, this Christmas I can guarantee that there's going to be lots of parents who are upset this Christmas, lots of kids that are upset this Christmas, and there's going to be lots of parents that are in debt this Christmas. So please, this Christmas, tell your parents that you're grateful for everything they've done for you, and you'll be grateful for everything you get, and you don't want much, you don't want much, right? Just tell them you don't want much. This won't just make them happier, it'll also make you happier about yourself, because you'll feel like a better person, and Christmas should actually be about telling your parents or your friends or whoever's there for you just how much you love them and just how much you appreciate everything they've done for you and if you fell out with someone this year then maybe try to make up to them and if you're one of these people who think why should I say sorry they're the ones that caused the problem then think of this that other person is going to be thinking the exact same thing so you're not going to make up and you're not be going to become friends or whatever again so please just say sorry to that person and they might say sorry back and you'll get a friend back. And there's nothing better than getting a friend back and I know through personal experience. But anyway, Christmas should be about sharing the love, showing people how much you love them, showing your appreciation towards them and just making everyone happy. Nobody should feel left out at Christmas whatsoever. And it really does upset me when I see people who feel left out people who are upset over Christmas because they didn't get what our kids got and stuff. But anyway, don't make our kids feel jealous at Christmas because that upsets them and upsets their parents. And it shouldn't be about gifts at Christmas. We shouldn't have to go and spend thousands on gifts just to make someone happy. Because that happiness doesn't last forever. That happiness lasts for about a week. And after them gifts get born, what we're going to do, we're going to ask for more gifts, which costs more money, which causes more debt problems. So, happiness doesn't come from money and doesn't come from gifts. Sure, you can get some happiness from it, but it's not eternal happiness. The only true happiness which you can get from Christmas, in my opinion, is from your family. So please spend your time wisely this Christmas and accept that you've got a great family. Accept that you've got someone there for you. Be grateful for everything they've done for you and just appreciate everything they've done for you. You can change the world by changing yourself. It's so easy to do. Just simply make everyone happy. So, I don't believe that everyone should be asking for a new computer at Christmas, because that's just ridiculous. You've got to learn to accept that your parents maybe can't afford it. And it does upset your parents when you tell them that you want all this stuff. So if you just say to them, Mum, Dad, I'm grateful for whatever you get me and I don't want you going out your way to get me something that you can't afford and it'll make their day and it'll make you feel like a better person and this has actually been a really touchy subject for me and it's been hard for me to express my opinions about it but I hope you understood so have a great Christmas everyone and as I've said change the world by changing yourself and make everyone feel welcome at Christmas make everyone feel warm and happy goodbye I love you all